Hey guys, it's Brenda from my wee Reborn's Cradle. Yesterday I was spending some time with Darius. He is my Quinlan sculpt by Laura Lee Eagles. And I had him in the car seat for a long, long time. As some of you may have known, if you've been with me for a long time, I do have a star of the car seat. I have a car seat over here in my living room. And every once in a while, I put a new doll in there so I can look at and enjoy. And every once in a while, I want to pick them up and cuddle them. So yesterday evening, I was picking up Darius. And I noticed that his diaper needed a new one because the edges are starting to rip. It happens over time. <laughs> so I put a new one on. And... <laughs> Francis looked over at him and said, oh, she's all clean now and smells fresh. Like, you know, just playing along with a, with a role play thing. And I said, hmm. Well, I thought he called her a she or called him a she. So I thought, I asked him, I said, do you think this one looks like a girl? And he looks over at her and stares and says, yeah. I'm like, oh, interesting, because he's a boy. <laughs> His name is Darius. And I said, you really think that he looks like a girl? And he said, yeah. So I thought, okay. I, because he has such an interest in the dolls, which is doesn't happen very often, I thought, I am going to change him into a girl and give him a new name. So it was really cool. Francis helped me pick a name for this little one. So stay tuned and you'll see the reveal. Aw, so there's Darius, soon to be... A girl I found some a very pretty girl outfit for him and I hope you can see everything I brought out this is a gender neutral um, old-fashioned glass um, baby bottle it has just a nani's no hole I've talked about nani's no hole in my videos before but what it is is a nipple with no hole so that you don't have to seal them or nothing they just come with no hole no hole nipples they're called i buy them online and apparently a lot more people are selling these kind of nipples now and this is fake milk on the inside i use um lotion and water i have tutorials on how i do that as well so here's my prop <laughs> for her i also have this beautiful uh crocheted teddy bear that Jen from Super Lily Sweet has made. She is wonderful at that. I wish I knew how to do those. And here's my Quinlan skull by Lorley Eagles. Oh, I brought up, I'm trying to go along with this vintage sort of theme. I have my beautiful knitted blanket here. I have my old fashioned crib sheet cover. Actually, it's just a giant um, blanket. I don't think it was ever a crib sheet cover. It might have been a crib sheet like sheet but I have a new diaper. This is an honest, not very vintagey, but it's very pretty. I love it. Strawberry uh, pink honest diaper and I have this bloomer eyelet um, bottom set. It looks kind of big but it's supposed to be kind of bulky anyway, but I love it. It's so cute. So here are the bloomers for the bottom. And then the top dress looks like it's an old-fashioned Peter Pan collar. And it's so pretty light pink with white flowers. And it's so, so pretty. So I thought it would look really cute big i'm not sure let's try it <laughs> and i found these socks these are i'm pretty sure that these were made 
they're just white socks with really beautiful lace ruffles and a pink rose so pretty so i thought that would go with the dress and i have a bonnet to go with the dress so let's get him out of this cute shirt <laughs> diaper as not a diaper shirt but this is a new diaper that i put on them last night i don't know i kind of like the simplicity of it i love this is what i used on my real sons of pampers maybe i'll just keep this diaper on and hopefully you stay in the frame maybe i'll move to the bottle or her bottle i I have to start saying her, her bottle. And the sun has been going in and out. So hopefully it will, it won't interfere the lighting too much. But this is a size zero to six month. It doesn't say. I'm pretty sure that I'll just go with this. Yeah. It's your six month. So it's a set and it's by Little Lindsay. If you can see that. Little Lindsay. So I hope that you're in focus and that you can see sometimes. My camera likes to autofocus. Now, I love this little one's skin tone. It's a little darker than my other babies. But I love that. I'm trying not to reach over too much because... Aww. <laughs> These bloomers. Sweet. Aww. Okay. Now for this dress. There's a button in the back. I hope that... I have to check the camera every once in a while. Make sure that you're in focus. That these pampers are honest away. Let's try this dress Oh, she looks sweet. But yeah, he, if Francis has an interest in my hobby, I would definitely love to honor that thought. Oh, this is so pretty. Oh my goodness. Oh, there's two of them. Oh my goodness. This is such a pretty. Oh my. It's <gasps> so pretty. Oh, I just want to pick her up. <laughs> oh my goodness, it's so cute. Let's see what these socks look like. These socks were meant for, I remember when I got these, they were on a different doll. I don't know, they might be way too big. Woo, <laughs> way too big. Maybe just leave it. Yeah, they're too big for her. These came with my, um, I named her Mila, but she was one of my, I think she was my second ever reborn doll. She was my first toddler anyway. Or second or third, I can't remember, but she is the Ronin sculpt by Riva Schick, and I named her Mila, Mila Jane. And these came with her. I'm pretty sure that her artist made these. They're very pretty. But yeah, they're too big. They're too big. But this, this bonnet should fit. This bonnet is the kind that's like readjustable. So, I've got 
let's just try. <laughs> it looks kind of new compared to this, but it's just, oh, I feel, she's so realistic that I feel like I'm smothering her, but I'm not. Okay, let's see if we can, can we make this shorter, or is that as small as we can get it? I think this is, oh, that's as small as I can get it. But I thought I was able to scrunch it more. I do have other bims, but this one might be too big. Oh, oh my goodness! <laughs> She's still so sweet. She is a belly plate. I should put that on. And go like this. <laughs> Aww. I love it. This suits her. Oh, she's so sweet. Let's see what she would look like. I can't put this in completely, but what we used to do is just smush. Oh my goodness, that looks so cute. She needs a bib though, I can't do that. I can't role play with this without a bit. It just, I can't. <laughs> the perfectionist in me just needs a bib. <laughs> Aww. So what do you guys think? Can she pull off being a girl? Okay, her head and camera looks a little off. Let's see if I go like this. Oh, she's so sweet. So, anyways, guys, Frances helped me um, come up with a name for her. We both watch <laughs> 90 Day Fiance. So, we're trying to think of a name that would suit her. And we both came up with the name Lauren Alexis. Lauren is on the show and she has a husband named Alexi. But I didn't want to use the name Alexi because I don't know, Lauren Alexi. I suggested that name and Frances said Alexis. So so that that's what her name will be. Oh, see a little. So welcome, Lauren. Lauren Alexis. Aww. I'm the picker. Oh my goodness. She's, yes, I could see her as a girl. <laughs> I could totally see her as a girl. Aww. And I'm totally in the wrong clothes to hold such a gorgeous, gorgeous girl like this. Aww. She is sweet. Um, she's so sweet. There was a doll in the community. Oh, I completely forgot about this channel. I remember um seeing these like these long. I remember the first time I seen a doll. Uh, she she wasn't a Lord of the Eagle sculpt. She was, oh. I completely forget the name of the sculpt, but I remember a lady in the community, she had a doll with eyebrows like that, and I thought it was so unique and interesting. But the channel's name was um, Sweet Maria Moments, I'm pretty sure. Oh, I kind of miss her. She, uh, she was in the community many years ago, and she had a doll. I can't rem remember the sculpt name but I do remember she had like long thin eyebrows like that and I thought it was so unique and now look at you I almost bought bought that sculpt too oh look at her oh yeah this this uh this bonnet is a bit big but 
Oh, she's so sweet. Oh my god, I can Let's see, here's her feet. Oh, let's see what she looks like up here, like this. Look a little bit. Oh my god. Oh, so sweet. Baby fixed right here. <laughs> oh. I don't know why I automatically, I do like a heartbeat. And then I always, that's my instinct. That's what I like to do. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for joining me. Oh, I love, oh. oh she's so sweet. <laughs> oh, look, at, look at her feet. Like a Lauren, and she, I think she could resemble a Lauren. She could totally pull off a Lauren. Aww, Lauren Alexis. <laughs> Anyways, guys, thank you so much for being here. I hope that you're doing well. Thank you so much for being a part of my channel. Um, I really, this sculpt is so cuddly. I love it. Oh, <laughs> do you see the tongue? I didn't even notice that until. Let's see, you can see, there's a tongue little sticking out in there. Oh. Thank you guys so much for being here. I hope that you're having a great day. And until next time, bye guys. Match your hand, guys. Magic, come on. Wave with me. Bye guys. Match my hand.